in Home and Away's 2024 season premiere on 8th of January 2024, we pick up exactly where we left off. Cash calls in the SES, as well as his sister Felicity, to help scour the remote bushland for any sign of Eden. But the search party are completely unaware Eden is being held captive at the mercy of the same men who left her best friend for dead. When she overhears the men making plans to get rid of her, Eden realizes that her time is running out. Will Cash track down Eden before it's too late? As Home and Away films most of its external scenes at the publicly accessible Palm Beach in Sydney's northern beaches, fans often get to see filming many months in advance of it hitting our screens. Thankfully, we've seen that Adam Rowland, Stephanie Panazzo and Emily Weir are all still filming, meaning that Remy, Eden and Mackenzie all survive their near-death experiences and will be on our screens well into 2024 and Bree split up as Bree finds a new man. However, there's bad news in store for fans of Remy and Bree. A fan of the show who watched filming at Palm Beach recently saw Julia Godwin, who plays Bree, kissing another actor, suggesting that we're just months away from a Bree and Remy split. The as-yet-unknown character is believed to be played by Perth-born actor Mohesh Jadu, who previously played recurring character Dr. Doug Harris in Neighbours between 2010 and 2011 and Ahmad in the Netflix series Marco Polo. Mahesh is followed on social media by a number of Home and Away's cast and crew, including Juliet Godwin, Jackie Purvis, and Stephanie Panazzo. There's no word yet on what causes Brie and Remy to split, and the pair were seen loved up in the season finale, with Brie conquering her fear of motorbikes after they took a trip out of Summer Bay together. However, Remy was then forced to tell Bree that he wouldn't go with her if she left Australia to work for Doctors Beyond Borders. Will their differing views on a new life abroad lead to a split? While fans initially suspected that newly single Tane would hook up with Dana next year, after photos showed him sitting next to the Matheson sisters at a formal event filmed earlier this year, new photos show that it'll actually be Dana and Xander who end up together. Photos taken by fan Danielle Stevens at Palm Beach in mid-November showed Luke and Ally filming a scene in which Xander approaches Dana, sitting next to her before the pair share a kiss. He briefly dated guest character Stacy, Malika Gaspari, earlier this year, but Stacy's desire for a polyamorous relationship ended up driving a wedge between them, culminating with Rose, Kirsty Marillier, catching Stacy cheating on her brother in a steamed-up car. A new relationship isn't the only development for newcomer Dana, as she gets herself a new job. More on that later. John quit as manager of Summer Bay Surf Life Saving Club in November, after being taken off teaching duties for berating Banjo Henderson, one of his bronze medallion students, whose father just so happened to be one of the club's major donors. While John wasn't sacked as surf club manager, the fact that he wasn't allowed to teach was enough to cause him to resign resulting in chaos as Alf, Raymar, finally realized just how much John did for the club. Alf eventually told Banjo's dad Simon, James Lugton, that he was going against his wishes and reinstating John, leading Simon to promise that there'd be as yet unseen consequences. Thankfully, it seems that John is well and truly back where he belongs in 2024, with recent photos from Palm Beach showing John is still working for the club as he scoots up and down the beach in his trusty Can-Am. And with John's star pupil Nikau departing earlier this year, it's time for someone else to take on the role of surf lifesaver. Fresh out of completing her bronze medallion, Dana Matheson is set to take up a job as a volunteer surf lifesaver, condemning her to a life of dealing with John Palmer. Pictures and video taken by fan Michelle Matthews in early November saw Ally Harris in full lifesaver uniform filming scenes in which she rushed into John's prized Can-Am, which had its flashing lights on. Dana recently took up a job as a nurse at Northern District's hospital, after being cleared of the drug charges she faced when she first arrived in Summer Bay.